absolutely we need to put uh, solar panels on existing infrastructure and not tear down trees. I think that's a, that's a pretty simple value statement. Um, but it's not just about, you know, looking at this as, okay, we save the trees and we put the, the, the um, solar panels in on existing buildings. It's where are we allowing uh, infrastructure and buildings to go up, right? So as we're developing more housing in our state, how is that housing going to be supported going forward? And are we doing everything we can at every step of the way? Are we educating our kids to prepare them for the jobs uh, that, are, that are being developed right now uh, so that they're able to develop not, not just you know, be workers, but also develop businesses that, that absorb this new technology? And finally, it's about the power grid, right? That's one of the biggest hurdles that that developing and, and accepting these these panels has. It's how are they tying in to basically a black box that needs greater transparency in how it operates. And so I, I've done a few things uh, with regards to transparency in my time in public office, and I'm looking forward to bringing that uh, value of transparency to how we develop and grow the grid going forward.